to start streaming. I want to go back to what Megan said there, Drew, about getting off to a good start, especially defensively. This is going to be a different look than Washington has seen all year long. Yeah, and when you talk about getting off to a good start, it's going to be imperative. Let's see how the Wizards match up with this Twin Towers lineup with Carl Anthony Towns playing the four and Rudy Gobert at the five. And Christos Porzingis starts it with a... Cal Kuzma back into the starting lineup after missing last night's game in Boston. Porzingis tried it once. How about twice? Carl Anthony Towns and Rudy Gobert love the high low between the two bigs. How about Porzingis? Three times to start the party. He's got nine. Cal Kuzma once again rocks the rim. Quickly against guys like Porzingis. Turn it over there. Threw it right at the knees of Gobert. Kuzma, the dump off and the lay-in for Bradley Beal. And Chris Finch does not like what he sees. Good defense there by Kuzma. Travel. Like an offensive foul using his offhand as well. Al Kuzma with the show and go. What does the bench do for Washington? They've got this five-point lead. Can they keep it or build on it? Now you want to, you want them to extend it. You do not want the. I think they've definitely done their job. If you can extend this lead, especially Will into double figures. Here's Will Barton off glass. That's what he does. He gets into a game and get a bucket. And there's a stat out there: a screen assist. I mean, you set a good screen, you're not only going to get your teammate open, oh, you get yourself open. Especially when you think of the potent offense that the Boston Celtics have. It's a completely different team tonight for the Wizards. Too good of a shooter to be shooting below 80% from the foul line. And I'd like to see him get to the foul line even more. Send all our thoughts to everyone that has fought that battle. Absolutely. Not only the patients, but the, the families. The resiliency, I mean, that is tough. Ten times knocking down nine. Listen, we talk about the great game Porzingis is having. Is having. He's five points less. This is with the offensive rebound. Here's Beal out to Kuzma. Three's good. Now Kuzma knocking down the three. Kuz and Beal both with 15. Porzingis with 29. Good hands, good deflections there by Washington. Shot clock at two. Towns has to get up a, a jumper. A leak out to Kuz behind the back to Monte Morris. He misses, but he gets the offensive rebound. Here's oh, Kuz. Wow, Paul Anthony. Count it. Something happened to Cat. I don't know what happened to the cramp. Jalen Brown last night. Good flash in the paint there by Jordan Goodwin. Good pass by Kyle. There's Kyle Kuzma out to Will Barton. Triggers and hits a three. It looks like Rudy Gobert is going to become that focal point as the primary scoring big. Corner Kuz. Yes, sir. It's not just what the big three are doing, though, but it's the contributions from the others. And they've had just that tonight. 37 pitch points as Kuz with a nice reverse lay-in. The defense there by Porzingis using his 7-3 height. Get that man 40. He ties his career high. Kyle Anderson stepped through. Gets his offensive rebound. 